Welcome, this is Travis Huzzy, auctioneer 1569 for the Aroostook Auction Barn. We're going to preview today the July 9th Tibbetts Family Auction, the complete estate auction at 457 Garfield Road in Garfield, Maine. Right here, just a few minutes outside of Ashland. You take Route 11, cross the bridge like you're going to Portage, turn left, turn left at the first Y, and just a few miles out, you'll follow the auction signs right here at 457 Garfield. Our mission statement at the Aroostook Auction Barn is to provide Aroostook County residents with a friendly, reliable, honest, and trustworthy place to exchange items and goods at the best price. We strive to be the county selling place where everyone's welcome and old and new friends gather for a day of fun. We're going to head off and, pre and preview this wonderful complete estate here at 457 Garfield Road, Garfield, Maine. Here we are, we're going to go right inside and look at some wonderful antiques and household items that are going to be selling at the auction. As you can see here, there's a nice purple recliner rocker, there's a cracker barrel rocker here, we've got the uh, Hoover vacuum cleaner as well, we've got uh, a beautiful antique dresser style with several plants, we've got some lights. We've got a nice wooden kitchen shelf here. We've got another white one for your kitchen items. We've got a little green kitchen uh, shelf as well with another plant going. We've got this beautiful Amish built dining room set out of hard wood. We've got a humidifier over there behind it. We've got a, a very nice table with a marble top. We've got the display case with curved glass. Moving on over here, we've got a, another little uh, table for your electronics. We've got a leather chair and ottoman. We've got this beautiful rug. We've got this exquisite coffee table, glass top, uh, checkers. We've got this wonderful leather, uh, great big surround piece. We've got lamps. We've got a leather rocker recliner here. And we're going to move off into the next room. We've got this beautiful vintage secretary, all hardwood in lovely shape. We've also got this uh, vintage desk with a flip up side and drawers. We've got a vintage potty in wonderful shape. And we've got this beautiful immaculate hutch. Look at that baby, she would look beautiful in the living room. Moving on, we've got right over here another beautiful uh, bedroom set. Uh, we've got with a mirror, we've got a nice table, we've got a rocking chair. We've got, uh, of course, another uh, uh, plant. We've got a beautiful hardwood bedroom set with all the bedding. Moving on to the next room. We've got some nice hardwood TV trays. We've got this beautiful parlor set in wonderful shape. We've got this beautiful big brass table in the middle. We've got another drop leaf with a couple of chairs. This is a unique rocker recliner here, which is wonderful. We've got this hand-painted box as well. Some very unique antique items. Now we're going to move right on out into the yard. Your cedar, the power block wood chipper, the yard man snowblower. We got a really nice Troy built horse rototiller. We got this wonderful Husqvarna uh, lawnmower. We've got uh, certainly a weed whacker. We've got this beautiful Brinkman stainless steel outdoor barbecue. This is the baby you ought to have right now. We've got a uh, beautiful outdoor swinging. Steve, the top still in the package. We got two man saws, some really nice ones, the out yard door trellis. We've got some beautiful set of office chairs. We've got a parlor chair and a vintage uh, rocking chair. We've got some unique Christmas items in there. We've got all kinds of, we've got dolls and uh, little rocking chairs. We got a whole setup, awning setup for a camper. Uh, again, we're moving right around out back here. We've got a vintage uh, looking bike. We've got the snowmobile sled as well as the ice fishing shack. We've got some nice 16 inch tire, truck tires. And moving right around in here, if you like canning, you're going to want to be at this auction. Look at the canning jars. All these boxes and bags are all canning jars, clean and ready for your use. We've got a marble stand came out of a bank, as well as a parlor chair. We've got the love seat standing up. We've got some more barbecue items. We've got your potato uh, storage rack. We've got Christmas and totes full of everything. We've got more barbecue stuff. We've got a stair tepper, stepper, an auger. We've got a beautiful metal trunk. We've got this really nice vintage sleigh. We've got a corner cabinet, and we've got this wonderful little uh, parlor. It's not a parlor, but entryway chair, vintage one. This would look beautiful in your entryway. We're going to move right on over to the other part of the garage. Here we've got a couple of nice old town canoes. We've got the Discovery Sport on top. 
We've got a big pole for the canoes as well. Flashing over, we've got a, a wheelbarrow, and we've got the heavy-duty tomato baskets for your garden, and we know they're starting to come in now. We're going to move right inside to the shop. Here we are in the garage shop. We've got creepers. We've got rocking chairs. We've got old pictures. We've got silver and plate. We've got cans. We've got other chairs. We've got a rototiller. We've got lamps. We've got uh, a little fireplace. We've got some... Uh, camera stuff. We've got a drill press. We've got more pictures. We've got outside chairs. We've got Christmas and decorations. We've got all kinds of knickknacks of bears. We've got roosters of every kind. Mirrors. Another beautiful rocking chair there. We've got some wooden uh, magazine holders. We've got some kitchen items and grinders. We've got puzzles. We've got LED lights. We've got the nice auger and the tip-ups for ice fishing. We've got a little bit more silver. We've got oil lamps. We've got games. We've got a beautiful table here. We've got all kinds of glasses and vases. A little bit of everything down in there. We've got more chickens and roosters. And look at the glassware, the outdoor pots. You name it, we've got a lot of that stuff. Backing right up around here, we've got all kinds of picture frames, more knickknacks, entry items, uh, canister sets. We've got moving around here, we've got the glassware that you, if you like glassware, you'll want to be here. Look at the carnival glass. There's never been a better set of carnival glass, milk glass. Look at the pictures. It is beautiful. You won't want to miss that if you love antique glass. We've got Tonka. If you like Tonka underneath, look what we got. Dump trucks, cranes. We've got payloaders, backhoes. You name it, we've got it. What a beautiful set we've got there. Moving right along, we've got fishing items. We've got toolboxes full, or fishing boxes full, full of items. We've got fishing poles. We've got it sitting all against this beautiful wood lathe, like new, never really used. We've got oars, a silent glow, hand tools and scrapers or wooden roof rake. Uh, we've got all kinds of uh, electrical cords. We've got more fishing items and lights. We've got uh, chains and binders and outdoor chairs. We've got uh, nails and drill sets. Uh, we've got staple guns. We've got tap and dies. We've got a beautiful cutoff saw here. Look, underneath we've got some custom router sets. Uh, routers for making canoes and doors. Over here we've got all kinds of stuff. We've got rigid and routers. We've got bar clamps and cutters. We've got uh, drills. We've got air nailers. We've got uh, battery powered skill saws and cutoff saws. We've got a radial arm saw, hand saws and hand uh, planers. We've got a craftsman laser level lights. We've got a bench top router shapers. We've got rigid and Ryobi sanders. We've got a huge craftsman sander and a great big table saw behind there. She's a beauty. We've got more handheld saws. We've got uh, grinders and clamps. We've got the king of the king. We've got D-wall planer. And underneath there is the, the, uh, the uh, sander, the craftsman toolbox. We've got all kinds of uh, screwdrivers and things. We've got a whole bin full of nails. We've got more craftsman routers and a uh, uh, Makita planer. We got the little saw down there as well. We got a joiner under there, another nailers. We've got tools. We've got craftsmen and other hand tools. We got wrench sets. We've got tapes and hammers and staples. You name it, we've got a lot of stuff. We got another little table saw there. We got a 14 inch wood bandsaw with a stand of its own. We've got uh, some hand carts looking around the corner there. We've got a beautiful pressure washer over there. We've got Makita generator, all serviced and ready to go. We've got uh, jacks and we've got an air compressor. We've got a banding uh, machine with all the banders. We've got a little buzz box there. Well, they're like new. You name it, we've got it. Again, this is Travis, uh, auctioneer at the Aroostook Auction Barn here at the Tibbetts Family Auction here in Garfield, Maine. If you like antique and uh, really high-end furniture, if you like outdoor gear, some rare items, glassware, if you like tools and equipment, you're not going to want to miss this complete auction on July 9th, the Tibbetts Family Auction in Garfield, Maine. See you at the auction!